when you reflect on your life, sir, and your public service, what are you most proud of? I'm most proud of the people who are carrying the whole work, actually uh, willingly, uh, uh, tirelessly, and actually the newer generation which is coming. Let me take you to a journey, uh, Brother Muhammad uh, uh, Shafiq. Uh, we started uh, uh, Islamic League, the Muslim Aid, the 84 and 85. There was no Muslim charities, a humanitarian organization. But we started a humanitarian movement in 1984 in UK. Now there's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of humanitarian organizations from the Islamic background, whether in UK or in Europe or in America. And this was the first step on the 17th of January 1984 from Birmingham, from UK. We are very proud of this, Brother Muhammad. What we need to do now is to start to create social movement. What do you mean by social movement? Social movement, when we look at every individual inside the society in UK and outside UK, what does it mean? It means that we should look at the local programs, the elderly, the sick people, the homeless, the runaway girls and boys, mm -hmm. and all these local programs which we need to respond to it. It's more tiring than actually the humanitarian work. You know why, Brother Muhammad Shafiq? Because humanitarian work is emotional. I can make you cry to get the money out of your pocket. But when I talk about social work, I, do, I cannot make you cry. Very difficult to raise funds for local domestic program. Very easy to raise funds for humanitarian response. Okay. That's why most of Thank our organization nowadays... Is yeah. I'm sorry I'm cutting you off there, uh, Dr. Hani al uh, now Thank you so much for joining us tonight. I've really enjoyed our time together here on British Muslim TV. We wish you well for Ramadan to you and your family. That was the UK pioneer, Dr. Hane al -Bana, the humanitarian activist, campaigner, leader, joining us live from Birmingham.